Alright, so with the conclusion of the 2012 draft, I thought I'd start a little series where I keep updates on the Houston Texans, my home team. So, I'm going to start with all the picks that the Houston Texans took in the draft, and one or, and Case Keenum, who they took as a free agent. They started off the first round with Whitney Merciless, defensive back, outside linebacker, defensive end, sorry, outside linebacker, Illinois. He's fast, skilled, He'll, he won't start for the Texans, but he'll get a lot of playing time off the bench, so I thought he was a good pick. We obviously needed a third defensive end, and he'll fit the job. Uh, we traded our round two pick for another for two a third round a third round pick and a fourth round pick. In the fourth round, we took Devire Posey. I hope I'm saying that right. Wide receiver, Ohio State. It was a risky move considering he was an unknown receiver, and he had two suspensions for a total of ten games in his college season. But they th the Texans thought that he was a good pick still because he showed that he still came to practice during that those suspensions and he still worked hard and they think he'll be a good leader. Next in the third round we took Brandon Brooks, offensive guard, Miami. 6'5", 343 pounds. That's huge in case you don't know for the offensive, even for an offensive lineman. He's a great run blocker and we'll see how he does with the pass. Ben Jones in the fourth round, center, Georgia. He's a lot like Chris Myers, the center we currently have, so that should be a good transition if we need to bring him up. Fourth round, again, Kayshawn Martin, wide receiver, Michigan State. Now we took these two wide receivers because Andre Johnson, great as he is, getting old. His hamstrings aren't what they used to be. They've had to do who knows how many surgeries on him. And he will also double, though, as our punt returner for Jac Jacoby Jones who obviously didn't do so well last de last season in the playoffs. So he'll be our new punt returner, Who and we didn't even re-sign J Jacoby Jones. Uh, Jared Crick, defensive end, Nebraska, fourth round. Don't uh, Randy Bullock, kicker, Texas A&M, in the fifth round. Now, usually you don't take kickers, so this was a pretty big step, but we definitely needed one considering we did not re-sign Neil Rackers. And then we also took free agent Case Keenum, U of H, quarterback. We needed a third string quarterback, and I think this was a good decision because this way uh, Yates won't feel too threatened, and he'll still get his, you know, good amount of time, and we'll have our first, second, and third strings all set up. So, God willing, we won't, but hopefully we won't have to use that third string, but at least we'll have him. So I'm going to try and keep you all updated every week for the Texans games. And I'll probably do one those Mondays after the games. So stay tuned if you want to keep up, if you ever miss a game or you just want to hear some uh, commentary. Thanks for watching.